All righty, guys and gals, welcome back to Red Dead Redemption. Looks like Dutch is uh, giving one of his speeches. So all of you keep busy and stay out of the worst of trouble out there. <laughs> we made it! I like Dutch, but I got a, a weird feeling about Dutch. I feel like there's something we're going to find out about him. The only reason I think that is because, one, he adopted us when we were little, and I'm curious about the circumstances of that. And there's some incident that happened on a ferry that we, I've not found out the details yet. I don't know. But he seems like a good dude otherwise. Hi there, How you doing, ma'am? How are you? How do I, I can greet you? Hi. So that feller who was hassling you Valentine. I'll tell you another time, okay? Okay, sure. All right. Shane, Shane with it right now. One of the first things we're going to do this episode, let me show you something. Look at my face. Looks like we sleep in a, a hog wash. For sparing me like that. I'll work hard. I am not a bad fella. You'll soon warm to me. Don't Just kiss ass, man. Oh, you will. And boy... Thank you for saving my life. Well, yeah, of course. There we go. All right, a little camaraderie here. He did save her life. Okay, one of the first things we're going to do, I've heard you can take a bath at a hotel or wash yourself well, hell, that's great. Uh, in a stream. Oh, no, that's what we're going to do. Also, this episode, we are going to go see who Mary Linton is. We're going to leave the boys and the girls at the camp here. We're going to head on out. Hope you guys and gals are doing well. I'm not doing too bad. So let's have a look on the map here. So Mary Linton, we've received a letter from her. She's up here, and there's the Dakota River. So let's go wash. We'll head, uh, yeah, we'll just keep, we'll head it straight up. Well, we also have a river down here. Let's go down this way first. <laughs> You're a good boy. You're a good boy, Lucky. Let's get washed up. We are filthy. What's that, a beaver? I wonder if they just had it stuffed. You know what that is. <laughs> Maybe it was a fish. I could have swore I saw something. Okay, we're going to see if I can get clean here. We got fish in the water. I have no other options here. How's that cold water on your balls, Morgan? <laughs> I can't. I'm trying to crouch, but I... Wait, whoa. Oh. There we go. Get cleaned up, boy. Filthy, man. We actually look a little cleaner today. We do look cleaner right now. I got a $5 bounty I got to pay this damn thing. Okay, fella. Well, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let's... uh. Let's give our, let's give Lucky some love here. That's I'm gonna brush him down. He loves that. Hey, come on, boy. Here's a good boy. Maybe take him through the water, get him washed up. Let's feed him. Maybe a sugar cube. Apple. He loves a damn apple. Let's get him rinsed off here. Cool him down. There's a boy. There we go. He seems to love it. Old Dutch's chain, Sally. 
What the hell we got going on over here? What the? What the fuck is going on here? What the fuck is going on? Is this over a five dollar bounty? Jesus! We're gonna get away. I'm gonna get even with these motherfuckers. Holy shit, man. I was not expecting that. I've got a $5 bounty on my head, so I'm being... I'm, they're trying to kill me? <laughs> they're still fucking coming! Okay, they're, I think they're gone here. Jesus. All right, I got to get to a post office and pay this damn bounty. That's a lot of dudes after me, man. <laughs> That's insane. All right, we're going to Valentine. Uh, let's head. Yeah, this is where uh, Mary Linton is anyway. Let's see if we can get up here. Without being hunted down like a damn animal. Yeah. Howdy. You seen about ten dudes with guns? <laughs> we get up this way? Let me see if I can get up this way. I mean, five dollars had some weight in eighteen ninety nine. I guess you know. He keep, keep heading this way. I'm not uh, run off a cliff here. Ride hard. See, we get to the damn post office. Maybe I need to do it in another uh, town, though. Uh, why didn't I put that away? I know. I, I'm trying to fucking get rid of it. Move. Shut the fuck up for a strangle, you boy. I'm a wanted man. Wait, this is the auction yard. We need to... 
Oh, it's around this way. Hold on, what's this? Valentine Station? I wonder if I could pay it here. Maybe. Let me get off the horse. I'm all nervous I'm going to be hunted down. Howdy. Howdy. How's it going? How do? Watch out. You ain't scaring nobody. Move your ass. Oh, sorry about that. Sorry, man. Oh, fuck. Damn you. You good? Yeah, you are. Just trying to pay my bounty. <laughs> now that I know how to block, I'm a badass. <laughs> Get fucking wrecked. Watch it, dummy. Look at me. Get off of my trail. Yeah. Okay, let me see if I can pay my bounty without uh, murdering anybody else. Welcome, hey. welcome. How you doing? Glad to see you on the up and up. Yeah, new Hanover. There we go. All right. Now we're free to murder again. <laughs> Looks like you lost your hat. How's it going? Oh, is that my hat? The hell do you say? My breath at some point. Yeah. Exactly. Howdy. Howdy, how you doing? Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Good to go. Okay. I've had enough of you. That is something else. Curl that devil up. I bet the law won't hear about that. Horse theft? What do you mean, fucking horse theft, man? This is my horse. Oh, it's maybe not. Son of a... <laughs> fucking hell, are you kidding me, dude? What the fuck is going on, man? Put him down now. No way out. You missed the way out. Damn it, the hell is in there. So we kill this asshole. This is insane, dude. Here comes Lucky. Oh, we gotta lay low so I can pay my fucking bounty. So I think what happened there, I thought this was my horse I tried to get on, and it was this other dude's horse. For fuck's sake, man. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, he's coming. They're coming. I gotta... Oh, fuck. I didn't run quick enough. Get, get, get on him! Get on the fucking horse! What the hell just happened there? What was that? All right, let's lay low. Let me hide here. Oh, 
Uh, they're going that way. I think we lost them here. We're almost finished. I'll get back to the post office and pay my fucking bounty. <laughs> God damn. That's because I didn't hitch the horse. I guess it... Yep. He moved up. He moved off from where I was. These lawmen here. Good God. A bounty of five dollars. People are willing to kill you. You get the bounty. All right, let's go this way. We're gonna go right to the post office. Hell of a way to start. Hell of a way to start today, Arthur. I could sneak in there. I got the, I had this red circle on the map. I wonder if that means they're still actively looking. See what happens here. Yeah, it's still there. It, but it's getting smaller, it looks like. I guess that's the search radius, maybe. So I, I go in there, I probably just spotted immediately, right? It's probably what the deal is. Where's my looky glass at? Where the hell's that thing at? Here we go. Did I pick it? Well, they're just waiting out there. Get them. Or maybe they're just sitting. <laughs> Fuck, man. Well, I could go to another town. It's probably the best way to do it. I could go to another town and pay the bounty. Yeah, so I've got, this is where I'm wanted here. I need to wait. I was thinking that the law guy would just say, like, put your hands up and I'd surrender, but they were fucking trying to kill me. Surely they'll, you know, they'll, they'll piss off here. There, he's leaving. Horse wants a brush here.
Okay, the, I, it disappeared. No, it's still there. The red line's still there. I see. But it looks like it's getting smaller. It is getting smaller. If I can get into the building and pay the bounty. The other thing I could do is maybe just go into the sheriff's office and pay it, but I'm afraid I'm going to get shot. Suspicious as hell, don't it? I'm sneaking around. Maybe this is their sight radius right here. Wait a little bit longer here, I guess. What if I could sleep? There's a way to do that. If I'm sighted on spot here. Got a guy on the porch. Yeah, if I could just get in and pay the bounty. Pay my bounty. Be a lot easier for you once you're all square. There we go. <laughs> farewell. All right, farewell. Let's see if I can stay the fuck out of trouble for uh, five seconds here. All right, Mary Linton. <laughs> Arthur Morgan doesn't take kindly to being uh, disrespected, talked down to. A lot like me. I'm just going to play this character like I would play it. If somebody walked by me and said, get the hell out of the way. <laughs> no, I don't think so. Let's hitch up here. Never mind. I have the time off work now, and the doctor's got me on some mighty fine, whew, whatever it is in that bottle. <laughs> and to think you're a church-going man. I certainly am. Oh, oh, hey, friend. Remember me? Hey, you look familiar. Hey, Wallace. This year's the kind soul I was telling I you I saved about. him. <laughs> the one that gave you the medicine when the snake got you. <clears throat> mm -hmm. I guess so. Listen, friend, I know I can never repay you, but... How about you head over to the gunsmith and pick out your choice of item on my tab? Oh, really? Well, thanks. Yeah, seemed like the least I could do with him being sent straight from the Almighty to save my life. Yeah, 
the Almighty. Wow, well, good deeds Always pay off, don't they? Are. I'm a man of this world, not the next one. Anyway. Well, we're doing this. I gotta wait until morning. All right, we can do this. Wait till they open. I'll get a gun here. Good deeds paying off. I like it. Ain't no thief ever went straight. Just waiting on the next job, right? I hear you. You know where any stagecoaches are? Greetings. What How can you doing? I do for you? Um, I like oh, the browse your catalog. You're that fellow who had to fight with Tommy outside of Smithfields? No. Yep. No, I don't think that was me. People are still talking about that fight. I ain't. Yeah, fair enough. Neither's Tommy. Anyway, how can I help you today? Um. Revolvers or pistols? Let's look at some revolvers here. Oh, it shows me the damage and the fire rate. Let's we'll see if we got something that does big dam here. That does good damage right there. Volcanic pistol. Okay, let's keep that in mind. Carbine repeater. Ooh, the Litchfield repeater. That does some real nice damage. That's good, too. It's got great range. It's got great accuracy on it. Okay, so for right now, it's a Springfield rifle. Oh, man, they just keep getting better. Oh, I can't get that. It says it's locked. Sawed-off shotgun. I think I have. Yeah, I've got one of these. That does good damage, so all right. I, I have that one. Maybe I just get some ammo here. Yeah, I mean, what's the sense? Well, hold on. I'll tell you what. He had another option. Let me do. Let me see what customize is here. Mind. Worth a shot. Equipped a shoulder. I think I need to sell... Well, I don't know. I need to be using this one a lot. That doesn't do very much damage right here. Tell you what, I'm going to sell my Cattleman Revolver. Old Crawford at Carmody Dell had a wagon stolen from his barn. You don't say. This is to start with, mind you. Hmm. That's interesting. How do I... Can I just sell something here? Well, all right. This will be here when you need it. All right. We'll come back here. I want to sell my gun here. I got to be more careful. Yeah, you do, sir. But I'm not looking to uh, get any scraps. Let's see. Where's the uh, general store? What do we got here? That's the bank. Where the hell's the general store? Here we go, right here. Let's see if this guy will buy my, my gun. Sorry about that. Got everything you need. Have a look. That's how I come in. Sell. Righty. Let's see what you're selling. Indeed. He doesn't he doesn't want my He doesn't want that. Okay, we'll sell that. You want it? That ain't nothing special, but sure. What was I just selling there? Right. I think I sold the wrong damn thing there. What's this? 
Oh, he doesn't. Does he not want that? Appreciate it. What the hell's going on? Horse medicine, health cure. What is this? Oh, gun oil. I want to keep that on me. Yeah, he doesn't want. He doesn't want my gun. Let's buy. Get some more provisions here. Anything in there you need. We, should, we could also make some stuff as well. That might not be a bad idea. These tonics are hilarious, man. <laughs> Ridiculous. Cocaine gum. <laughs> nice. Take one of those. Hair pomade. <laughs> um, cover scent lotion. Live crickets, live worms. This is for fishing. Wouldn't mind getting into some of that. Horse medicine. All right. The smell of sheep shit in this town <laughs> never goes away. That's it for now. I guess I can't sell my weapon. Hold on. Let me look. Who would, who would buy a weapon? I mean, I think it would be this guy, right? Apparently not. He doesn't want it. He's not going to want it. What is this? What is that? Let's go. S oh, it's bounty hunting. Okay. Well, let's go back over here. Who's saying that? What the hell's going on? Oh, this guy's got a sign out here. That's how I come into stores, sir. <laughs> Good thing there wasn't anybody behind the door. They would have been killed. <laughs> Let me see what's available. All right, let's just buy something here. Oh, I can go to the um, the fence and sell this stuff, probably. So I've got this, which I want to sell that. I do want to sell it. So we'll get an upgraded gun here. I don't know why some of these are locked. I've got that, which is seems pretty good. I sold to a bounty hunter last week. <laughs> that boy's out looking to get someone, that's for sure. And I've got that. I think we just keep this. Although the range is absolutely shit on it, I see. So I got to get better about what guns I'm choosing to use here. Yeah, I mean, if I'm close with that, it's great. Obviously, I put my pistol down as a bid in poker the other night. I'm trying to browse your catalog, sir. Damn. You'll see a few people in town with that too. Yeah, that's good to know. This thing has great reload right here, but I, that's what I have. All right, these just don't do any damage. All right, I think what I'm going to do here, I'm going to sell this. I'm going to buy the Volcanic Pistol here. It's pretty good damage. Yeah, I like Carry that. It with pride. Yes, sir. Components. It's a nice piece and all, but I'd personally add some rifling. Take it or leave it. That improves my accuracy yep. a little bit. This is the one. What does the grip you know do what? for me? Bet you you could use some rifling on this thing. Oh, it just changes the grip. What about the barrel? Does it improve anything? Customized groove for improved bullet stability? Mm. 
He likes that. <laughs> we can do a lot with this. New trigger, brand new bolt, your pick. What about ammunition? Well, it Heavy velocity. Up on ammo. You never know. Right, we got quite a bit. I'd recommend loading up on extra ammo. I bet you would. I bet you'd recommend that. <laughs> All right, see if I can sell to him now that I've I've got my free thing here. Keep looking, no problem. Like I can't sell. He doesn't want to buy anything. Let's have a look. Yeah, I can't sell. Okay. Oh, I'm real excited to try this. I bet you are, Arthur. You ready to kill somebody? Look at that. Can you give me some money? That boy ain't right in the head. He's like a kid waving a toy around. The fuck you say? I well, I did I did draw my gun, didn't I? <laughs> All right. Let's go see How you doing? Let's go see if we can find Mary Linton here. She is uh a little ways off. Let's get get her horse. I'm going to go to the fence and we will where the hell did my horse go? Morning, sir. I think you caused enough trouble around here, don't you? Fella out. Read about the horse for the Leviticus Cornwall. Mm. Make sure it's my horse. I don't want to be stealing. Give me a dime. Give me something. Got a little bit of lag in the game today. Kind of strange. Thought I was going to take a tumble there. Is this her? It is her. We loved once and true, part two. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to disturb you, ma'am. Uh, is um, is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. You don't know if she's there. Linton. A caller. Oh, I guess you. she wants to see if she wants she wants to see anybody. See if I remember this. No, I don't remember her. Hey. Hello, Arthur. How's it going, Mary? <laughs> Yo. Mary? Yeah. I heard you and your friends was around. I... Okay. Glad we got cleaned up. Where's what's-his-name? Died. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh, well, you've been, <clears throat> you've been made a widow and you come here looking for me, is that it? No, ain't like that, Arthur. Ah, okay. Hell of a thing to say. I, <laughs> my family, I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. I always liked Jamie, at least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart? Don't make me beg you, Arthur. My money, my life, me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Go That's probably that guy outside with the, mad, the flyer. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but... But I think well, She's of you asking, often. not the family, so... A long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life and not the... 
nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for him. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. His beard's growing back. I've just noticed that. The Please. beard does grow. Arthur. I like that. Will you help me? Yes. Yeah. Where is he? Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. All right. We got some honor there. Interesting. Let's have a look here. Um, where's this guy hold up at? All right, we're gonna head. Uh, we're gonna head this way. This is uh, for Mary. So we'll head. Uh, that's gonna be. We'll call that east by northeast here. Well, it's marked on the map, so we'll head that way. Yep. All right, this is pretty interesting. I don't know if I missed a lot of backstory or something with Mary. I don't think I did. We read the journal. I believe he mentioned something in the journal about her. Pick up some uh, some game for the camp. I've got extra ammo. We might be able to donate some of this ammo now. Howdy. So there's so many ways to RP this game. You create your character. We could have chose not to help her there. going on here her horse died damn oh hey you there think you can help a lady out my horse up and died on me twisted my ankle something fierce think you could give me a ride yeah sure hop on oh thank you sir thank you you know emerald ranch Mind taking me there? You gonna get your shit off your horse? We ain't hardly going nowhere at this speed. <laughs> Glad I ran into you. You want me to drop you <laughs> off? I that horse, you know. Yep. I can it buck your ass horse. off, you ungrateful oh, bitch. <laughs> hard. Sorry to hear that. Yeah. We ain't that hardly going nowhere. <laughs> Better than my husband, truth be told. That fool always complaining, but does he do something about it? Man, barely lives. Sure is chatty in away. here. Aside from to lift a drink, of course. Marriage for me has been nothing but trouble. But Biscuit, he was a fine animal, loyal, smart. Doesn't seem brave. like you were a fine owner Didn't if you've no rode the horse to death. No one. Had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once? I was riding up near the Dakota and had stopped by a nice warm patch. The Dakota. I like off, how they said that before North and South. I some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. Damn, folks. Well, he gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. You don't say. He his hide, too, as he was hollering away. Didn't think a man could run so fast. Yeah, where's your place at? We need to drop oh, you yeah. off. Yeah. I had a good laugh on that one. <laughs> I tell the husband, what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Gee, thanks. <coughs> so, you live at Emerald Ranch then? For the time being. I was looking for work. I was looking for some help with the gardens. If 
I waited any longer for my husband to put food on the table, I'd have died of starvation. I'll be moving on soon, though. Emerald Ranch, well, it's a strange place. How so? The owner's a mean bastard. Strange, too. The lights in bullying folk. Really? There's a daughter, but she never leaves the house. You can see her in the window sometimes. Oh, I got this thing I do to bullies. When I asked about her, everybody told me to leave it alone. Found an old saloon there, all shut down now. But I went in to have a look, and there's bullet holes, old blood stains. Something definitely happened there, but I couldn't figure it. Just an uncomfortable feeling to the place. Either way, it's time I left. Especially now I lost that poor horse. I'll collect my belongings and be on my way. Back home? I guess. I bet my husband's right where I left him. Bottle in hand. Alright. Got new country out here. Wait a minute. Is this... Oh, we're getting close now. Is this where we... Is this where our fence is? It is. This is where we brought the stolen wagon. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Well, this is good. I kind of want to see the fence anyway. I want to sell the cattleman's gun. You going to complain about the speed? Interesting turn of events here. Well, interesting we end up back here. Oh, here we go. This is great. This was kind of you, mister. Yes, ma'am. Please take this as my way of thanking you. Well, thank you. What? Appreciate it. She gave us a ring there. What a lousy day. Nice talking with you, ma'am. Good luck to you. You too. All the best. <laughs> this game is so good. Let's go see the fence here. Sell this ring, I guess. Like, what else are we going to do with it? Uh, let's go around the front, I think. We got some pretty uh, decent amount of honor. I could see doing a Let's Play this and just being a, a damn outlaw. There he is. Howdy. Don't you even think about raising a hand to me again. I didn't raise a hand to you. What is this? Pearl necklace? Pen? Yeah, I mean, what else are we going to do with this stuff, right? Three dollars? What is this? Silver earring? What the hell am I going to do with that? Oh, this is the dude right here, man. What do we have here? Okay, be used in crafting. That's interesting. I don't know if I need to save these cards. We've already, like, found them, so maybe not. Oh, he doesn't want weapons. Maybe you can't... I don't know, maybe you can't get rid of uh, weapons. What's this? I don't want bourbon on me. Hello again. Go on, have yourself a quick nosy. All righty, what you got to sell? Okay, let's see. It's probably all the shit I just gave him. <laughs> Wait. So old Bob Crawford was livid about his coach getting robbed. I bet he was. I was very sympathetic. This guy ain't got shit. Oh, he's got some stuff. Take beans. I don't want moonshine. Herbivore bait. Gun oil. I guess we'll get some of that. Wait, wait. Potent snake oil. 
Executor hood. Now that's interesting. Metal skull mask? Wow, some of this stuff is expensive. Documents. All right. All right, Seamus. Take it easy. Once you, uh. Yeah. You should, I don't know, do something, man. You need to look in the mirror because that's, it's just not, it's not looking <laughs> good, dude. All right, we've come a ways off the track here. How are we doing on time? About 50 minutes in. Howdy. You're back. You lift with your legs, bro. Fox. That felt kind of bad. I just killed a fox. I wonder if I should be skinning them first. It's two score two star quality. That feels kind of bad. Uh let's stow it. Come on now, boy. Well, we got people to feed. I want to get into some fishing too. I want to check that out. We got to get ourselves a fishing pole, some bait, see what that's all about. Maybe if I choose to skin it, then I get to like harvest things off of it. So I need some upgraded saddle bags as well. We had that problem when I killed the legendary bear. Speaking of the legendary bear, I need to find a trapper, I think. So I need to, we can make a camp. I got to remember how to do that. We might make a camp here. We're coming up on an hour into the episode. I don't want it too long. And then we'll find out what's going on with uh, Mary's brother, Jesse here. Or uh, not Jesse. What was his name? Something. See where we're heading here. Okay, we can go either way. Let's head up this way. I'm actually going to make a camp up here, I think, is what we'll do. Yeah. Let's make a camp out here. Let me get too close. These are some religious cults, so who knows what's going to happen up here. Well, I'll say cult. I don't know if she said religious. Seems like a good place to camp. Let's see. Can I remember how to do this? Um. Yeah, right here. It keeps it in a satchel. <laughs> Oh, I like it. Okay, it's just some, just a fire. We're going to sleep. You can access fire crafting. Fire crafting allows you to cook meat and make tonics. That's right. We know about this. Do I have anything to cook here? No, I've got nothing. Nothing on me. A lot of recipes, though. All 
All right, we're going to sleep. Left control, do it. We're doing some camping. Real camping. All right. We're going to call this an episode. Thank you very much for hanging out for a little bit. You guys and gals take care. Arthur and I will catch you in the next episode. Peace. Mm -hmm.